Yeah, it's mom. It's okay. <sighs> okay. <sighs> 50 mics on board, fentanyl. Okay. <sighs> I'm gonna drop this up right now. Okay, so what we're gonna do, you should start feeling this pain medicine soon, okay? <laughs> That's why we don't stop. Boy, yeah, family Jew, we don't quit. Boy, yeah, family Jew, we unstoppable. Boy, yeah, family Jew, the impossible. Boy, yeah, family Jews. Hey, Guess where this guy's finally going? This little, not little, this big teddy bear. Oh. Come on, Kevin and Cuts. Bill, you ready? Come on. Let's go. So we wanted to go like here, but he's so mad that they're gonna have to go to here. <laughs> I've been a bad dog parent. I mean, I've got a lot on my mind, but he is gonna be shaven pretty good <laughs> because he's so mad. At but at least he'll still have the teddy bear head and we are going to brush his teeth. <gasps> now I'm going to work. All right, Bill, are you ready? His heart's racing. Should we do the snap? Ready, Bill? Two, three. He's a different dog. <laughs> it doesn't even look like him. <laughs> I mean, look at his tail. He looks like a rat. <laughs> you are a rat, Bill. <laughs> I mean, his collar's loose. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Look at his rat tail. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I know. Does that feel weird? <laughs> they had to call me and say, it's just not worth like matting or um, going through the matted areas because it's going to hurt him. So he got bicked. But you look handsome. Should we see if Mabel recognizes you? It's gonna hurt more because when she pulls on his ears, it'll probably pinch more. I mean, this is like shorter than it is for summer. Oh, I didn't feel like it was that bad. I told him to put some cotton balls in his ears. Oh, buddy. Just not being able to hear. I'm not watching this. Her dry eye. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Not my dog. <laughs> he is shaved. <laughs> Don't let your dogs get too mad. <laughs> Let's see if Mabel recognizes you. Let's see if she recognizes Hey, hey, chill out. She doesn't know who it is. Oh, 
Oh, it is yes, really bad. Yes, we do have the person in the other car that heard her best. It's fine, Mom. Oh, I'm so sorry, Mom. That's okay. All right, here's my mom's wrist. Uh, okay, that's fine. We'll get through this, Mom. Okay. Let's start with 50. Hey, Xander. Yeah? Can you ask your mom if, if she can uh, get the ID for me? Uh, uh, yeah, it's Mom. In the, it's in the phone, okay? It's yeah. here. Uh, that's just a point. Uh, this right here. Yep. Okay, thanks. Yeah. Got this, Mom. It's okay. <sighs> Okay. Oh. 50 mics on board, fentanyl. Okay. I'm gonna drop this off right now. Okay, so what we're gonna do, you should start feeling this pain medicine soon, okay? Okay. It's gonna take the edge off of it, okay? okay? And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a splint around your wrist there. Okay. And then we're gonna move to my stretcher, okay? Okay. Well, I don't, I can walk. Well, we're is still, it? we got it right here. We're still gonna stand up. Okay. okay? And we're just gonna sit down on the stretcher, okay? Okay. You got this, Mom. Oh. I'm gonna give you some anti-nausea meds. Okay, that'd be great. Oh my! I feel like I'm in labor. My nice fingers, like my fingers are using, are losing them. This side? No, this one's okay, but that one's. But this one. That is... one's you're just breathing too fast. So if you, you slow think? your breathing down, yeah. If you slow your breathing down, then we'll be able to. It's just numb. Yeah. Do you have we'll take a peek. Any of fingers on the right side at all? I don't know. I. It... Yeah, don't force it okay. too much, okay? That's what I'm saying. I think, I think it's lost. It's like the blood supply is. Okay. Do you still have uh, more in that flush? Yeah. Uh, yeah. You want another one? I've got the flush here. Oh, okay. Two, yeah. four and two, Zolfran. Yeah. Zolfran going on board right now. And I apologize. It was my fault. I didn't, I didn't I'm look. I'm not worried about that right now. I'm worried um, about taking care of you, okay? Uh, I'm going to grab some. Okay, this is that anti-nausea medication, Thank okay? Thank you. Oh, gosh, Mom. Okay, I'm just moving yeah. your shirt just a little bit. I'm gonna cut you it. You just relax your arm. Oh, gonna... No, don't do it. Do you care it's if I cut that? It's my pollinator. Uh, <laughs> it'll be easier for us to, if okay, we can cut go it. Ahead. And then... No. I won't go too far, but just enough so that we don't uh. have to manipulate your wrist. I'm just like worried that I can't, that the blood flow is, is that going to cause a problem with my wrist? So right now, especially where we're going to out of you, a little bit of blood flow loss isn't a huge thing if there is a blood flow loss, okay? okay. Tourniquets have been left on for hours without adverse effects, <sighs> but we do need to get you to the hospital so that they can remedy it if there is a problem, okay? Okay. Just so that the so okay. Julianne is going to pick up his little bit. Oh, Xander. Oh, I'm okay. Okay. Oh, so, no, okay. I'm okay. Oh, okay. Okay. The kids are taking care of. Don't worry about the kids. I'll put that back in the phone for They're going. We've got it covered. Okay. Don't worry about it, okay? Okay. Let me do this. This sweet guy. Yeah, so she said she can stand. Is a viewer. Okay. <laughs> He's a fan. Okay. So I'm going to support you. Yeah, we're going to hold that and I'm going to support you. Bye, Xander. Is the mascara running? It's too big. <laughs> did they give you a room, Mark? Uh, what was that? Did they give you a room? They did not give me a room. I don't have time for this. First thing I'm gonna do is gonna clean off the top part of your wrist here. So hopefully some of your germs are on the skin while we'll give you the injection.
We're gonna put her under conscious sedation. Who said that? Oh, I did. <gasps> I'm videoing you. Look at me. Yeah. And try to put that back into place. Hi guys, so right now we're getting ready for school, but we have some really bad news. So, as you know, my mom got in a car crash and her hand, her right hand was snapped in half. So I'll show you guys that picture. And it's not, it does not look good, but she's doing well and it'll get better. But she's just with Mabel right now. So here she is. It's resting. Looking for her mom made her but they they want to know the saddest, the saddest part. What? You see this hair? Yeah. What is it? I guess. No, this. I'm holding it. Is that broken? It ripped? They had to cut uh, it. Uh, <laughs> Maybe I show them all the medicine. I'm good. Guys, this is what you do when your mom or your dad or your older sibling has a broken arm or leg or anything like that. are so worried about me. I love it. Well, you guys, there's not much to report here. Got this little baby right here. That little baby right there, they will not leave my side. That's actually really sweet. It's about 12.45, and I've just been eating a bunch of crackers, and I'm drugged on hydrocodone and ibuprofen. My freaking arm is killing me. Where's my arm? I can't even see my own arm. Can you guys see it? Anyway, so I will have surgery on Friday. And they're gonna put a plate in. Anyway, so I have to get a metal plate in my wrist. I don't even know how I'm gonna like edit. <laughs> I just love that these puppies are right here. Sorry, it's kind of dark. Um but I've just been kind of sleeping because I didn't get a lot of sleep last night. They didn't give me a very high dose of morphine. And I was like, man, my arm is still throbbing. And that was after taking morphine. So then when I saw the doctor this morning, he was like, oh yeah, we need to give you something heavier. <laughs> he said it's a common break. I mean, my wrist like broke in half. So... Did anyone even say how it happened? I just was pulling out after picking up Xander from the library after school and I think it was my I think it was my fault. I pulled out as a woman behind me was pulling in. So I clipped her right bumper in the back with my left bumper on the front. And she didn't even get hurt and Xander didn't even get hurt. I think that my hand may have gotten caught in the steering wheel. Just like when you go with a bike, you get caught in the spokes of a wheel. These weren't spokes, but somehow my wrist just snapped and it hurts so bad. So, lucky me. These dogs have not left my side, especially him. Hi. 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 Hi.
I couldn't do this without my family. All day long. I've got my sisters and sister-in-laws and friends all helping. The medicine just makes me kind of loopy. This puppy, you guys, she has been my little balm of Gilead, I tell you. I love her.